Well, new information also today to share about that horrible family murder suicide in Allen that took the lives of four people, and that did include a two year old child. As our Steve Pickett will share with you now, the family's loss of another child just a month ago may have been the reason behind the tragedy. This is the second time in my life that I have experienced um, multiple uh, deceased in one particular service. Uh, the last time was two years ago. For Allen Islamic Mosque leader Abdul Rahman Bashir, another unthinkable multi-family killing for Allen's Islamic community. Two years ago, six people, all victims in a murder-suicide pact. It shocked Bashir. Then on Monday, inside this small home, police find four members of the Sherwani family, including a two-year-old boy, all of them shot to death. This family and their extended family, they were a part of our congregation. Um, their children also come to the mosque for our Sunday school and other Islamic and Arabic services. Police confirmed the victims as Farman Sherwani, the husband, his wife Layla, their 12-year-old son Shaheen, and two-year-old son Mateen. Detectives point to family statements about a third child, a four-year-old daughter. She died in an accidental drowning a month ago as a tragedy that took a heavy emotional toll on the Sherwanis. A lot of things don't make sense, but one thing that we do understand is the immense grief that the entire family was trying to process and deal with. The Sherwanis are Kurdish Iraqi by nationality. Large family gatherings, we're told by neighbors, were often held inside this home. But no one apparently identified the emotional pain that led either a father or a mother to kill their spouse, their children, then themselves. In Allen, Steve Pickett, CBS News, Texas.